Welcome back to another episode of Daily Fortnite, your daily podcast about Fortnite. I'm your host, Mikey, aka Mike Daddy, aka Magnificent Mikey. Today we have a pretty cool piece of news to talk about, so let's get into it. This is introducing Post Party. Capture clips of Fortnite on PlayStation, Xbox, Nintendo Switch, and PC. Did a teammate shockwave an enemy your way so you could finish them off with a snowball? Or maybe you narrowly escaped defeat with a dirt bike getaway? No matter what achievement you just pulled off, make sure you never forget it by capturing a clip to share with others. With the new Post Party mobile app, capture clips of your Fortnite gameplay on PlayStation, Xbox, Nintendo Switch, and PC. Then watch and share the clips to social media. You can also save the clips to your mobile device. See how Post Party works with Fortnite below. Post Party can capture Rocket League clips too. How to capture Fortnite clips with Post Party. Download the Post Party app from your iOS or Android device. On iOS, download Post Party from the App Store. On Android, download Post Party from the Google Play Store or via the Epic Games app from the Samsung Galaxy Store. 2. Sign up to Post Party with your Epic Games account so that you can start capturing clips in Fortnite. 3. Launch Fortnite on your PlayStation 5, PlayStation 4, Xbox Series X or S, Xbox One, Nintendo Switch, or PC. Hold your platform's capture button or capture key to capture your last 30 seconds of gameplay. Please note that player voice chat and text is not included in the capture. So uh, just more specifically, it's the options button on the PlayStation controllers and the menu button on Xbox controllers, the plus button on Nintendo Switch controllers, and the escape button key on keyboard. Four, after your capture, the clip will appear in your post party app library. Processing may take up to five minutes. Select the clip and trim it to your desired length, with the minimum length being three seconds. Once you have your clip, how you like it, share it to the social media platform of your choice to show off your elim or other accomplishment. You can also save the clip to your mobile device. Please note, after each elimination you get in Fortnite, you'll receive an in-game prompt encouraging you to capture a clip if you signed up to post party with your Epic Games account. You can disable this prompt, but still capture your Fortnite gameplay anytime by turning off clipping reminders in the clipping section of Fortnite's account and privacy settings. Post Party can capture your Fortnite gameplay in Battle Royale and Creator Made Islands. However, it cannot capture your gameplay in Save the World. Okay, for me, this clipping um, reminders is going to be, you know, if you're somebody who gets a lot of eliminations, it's probably going to be beneficial for you to turn that off because you're probably not going to want to see that um, coming up on your screen all the time. If you're somebody like me who uh, the eliminations come rarely and you want to clip those because you want to <laughs> you just feel good about getting an elimination, then you probably might want to leave those reminders on so that you can actually capture your clips of getting eliminations anytime uh, one happens for you. Share your first Fortnite clip for in-game rewards. After sharing your first Fortnite clip from the Post Party app, receive the Post That Wrap and Post Party Confetti Spray in Fortnite next time you return to the in-game lobby. Capture the moment, post moment, then post it for others. So there you go. That's, uh, to me, like I said, this is a pretty cool uh, deal. Just because, you know, yeah, technically I'm a, I'm a content creator, right? Um, but everything I have, the PC that I, uh, you know, the PC that I do all of my content creating on is old. It's got to be at least 10 years old now. So it's, it's not the greatest. It's not easy for me to make, um, clips that I can post to social media. It was just something I always think about doing and want to do. It's just not easy for me to uh, do it with the equipment that I have. Uh, so um, 
just making it that much easier to share those fun moments uh, is really cool because there's always been so many fun moments where I'm like, oh, I wish I, I had that recorded or, you know, I wish I, you know, it was a easy, quick bite you know small file size i didn't have to like transfer over to my computer and then s put it into the um an editing program which again for my computer just to you know uh upload something into an editing program takes forever um you know to, to have it uh done faster for you and ready to go i, I think that's a big deal and it, it's just gonna make uh you know sharing content just for the regular casual player i think that much more fun because yeah we see all the big content creators right and we see the professional players and the cool stuff they could do but sometimes really cool stuff happens to us players as well just regular players that it that is really cool and that you want to share so um you know I, i'm actually kind of excited about this just to and see because i mean to me that was one of the fun things at the beginning of fortnite 2 right was just seeing all the wild things that people were posting of like oh can you believe this just happened in this game that i'm playing like there's a lot of moments like that that i'm sure uh, get missed all the time or just don't get shared because people um you know don't have a chance to record it or don't have the equipment to record it or or like me just you know it's not easy for them to uh upload it you know and, and edit it and do all that so uh, this is this is pretty cool in my opinion uh but that is all the news there is today let's go ahead and take a look at uh, a, a few ltms that we can uh hop into let's see you got things like zero alert free for all uh lukey's solo end game new tilted tower zone wars duo zone wars 32 players target rush uh prop hunt modern mall the fishy mansion ltm hiding game and a whole lot more to be discovered in that discover tab let's take a look at these quests we got search uh wait are we still on this same set of quests or did we start it okay here's the new list Again, and I'm a big fan that they are, you know, staying now and that you can have all season long to get them done from all the ones that come up now. So this this week's quests are called Slurp on Ice. You need to visit Frosty Furs, Lonely Labs, and Brutal Bastion. Travel on frozen surfaces, uh, 2,500 meters. We have Search Ice Machines or coolers 10 in total hit opponents while standing on snow or ice you got to do that 50 times uh you need to restore health or gain shields from slurp uh and you need to destroy slurp barrels um and then let's see I'm looking for... Oh, okay, so here it is in the Geralt of Rivia uh, quests. One of them is defeat a boss. And I, again, we have gamers loves... Or gamer loves gaming coming in with a great tip on YouTube with a comment saying... So, for the eliminate a boss challenge, all you need to do is load onto Team Rumble. Then you only need to hit the boss once... Then just leave him to die in the storm and the quest will count. So that will be an easy way to get that one done. If you're having troubles defeating a boss, boom, that's how you get it done. Be a boss, hit that boss just once, leave him to die in the storm in Team Rumble. All right. Uh, thank you again, Gamer Loves Gaming. And uh, let's head on over to that item shop now and see what we have in the item shop today. Uh, all right let's take a look here lots of stuff the love is in the air section um the kid Leroy items dragon ball items that's all still here and then we have the sunflower outfit for 800 tech ops outfit with capacitor backlink for 1200 squid striker harvesting tool for 800 little carpet ride emote for 500 praise the tomato emote for 500 the turn up music for 200. 
uh, Immortal Sands Bundle has Sandstorm Outfit, Scimitar Outfit, Chrono Contrail, and Emblem Wrap for 2000 That's 1300 off the total, and separately, Sandstorm Outfit is 1200 Scimitar Outfit is 1200 The Chrono Contrail is 400 The Emblem Wrap is 500 we got the Wild Frontier bundle, which has the Rustler outfit, Leather Luggage, Le Leather Lugger back bling, Wrangler outfit, Saddlebag back bling, Spurred Swinger Harvesting Tool, Rustler Plaid Wrap, Utility Axe Harvesting Tool for 2000 that's 1700 off the total. The Rustler outfit with Leather Lugger back bling is 1200 Wrangler outfit with saddlebag back blings 1200 Spurred Swinger Harvesting Tools 500 Utility Axe Harvesting Tools 500 Rustler Plaid Wrap is 300 uh, We got a new wrap, the Cosmos Wrap for 500 uh, You know, this is one of the type of uh, effects that I love where it's a galaxy theme and, you know, the, the, the gases are going across and... You see all the stars and stuff. I, I like the I like the looks of these. So again, that's five hundred for that. The dream outfit with the shattered wing back bling is one thousand two hundred. Gonna go great with that new wrap. The luminous outfit with lunar light back bling for one thousand five hundred. The astral axe harvesting tool for one thousand two hundred. The shard break wrap for five hundred. The arcana glider for one thousand two hundred. Uh, and let's see here. Oh, we got a bunch of NFL items in the item shop today. So if you want the NFL skins, those are 1,500 each. There's bundles of them as well for 3,500, which is 4,000 off of the total if you get the bundles. Uh, and again, you can customize these to be any NFL team you want. Uh, they got a bunch of different um, gear. Uh, you know, a bunch of different um, harvesting tools, gliders, emotes. Uh, they got referee outfits that are 800 V-Bucks each or in bundles for 2000 which would be 2000 off the total as well. So a lot of good stuff in here. I'm not going to go over every single one because there's a lot. Uh, but we went over the main prices of the, the main outfits themselves. So there you go uh, get those and rep whoever you think is winning the super bowl this weekend for me i think it's going to be the eagles but we shall see hopefully it hopefully it's a fun game uh but yeah uh that looks like everything today you can get any and all of these items using code mikey m m m i k i e in the item shop and some of the proceeds will go to help support the show and today my item of the day is the dream outfit i just really like this outfit i like the shattered wing back bling that it comes with as well uh you know it's just really um you know this was a, the 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 butterfly event you know that was really cool uh you know someone that you know was one of my uh favorite things that happened in fortnite i think so uh that's why i own the outfit already because uh you know it was just uh you know being connected to that i think it's it's a really cool uh, outfit so there you go that's going to be the episode for today so make sure you go join the daily fortnite discord and hang out with us follow me over on twitch twitter and youtube head over to apple Podcasts, leave a five star rating and a written review for a shout out on the show make sure you subscribe so you don't miss an episode and until next time have fun be safe and don't get lost in the storm